Hello there. <laughs> this is Ian here. Now today I'm going to speak about um, how to discern whether something that you watch on YouTube, whether it is the truth or whether it is some sort of a lie, because we have been told many things. And what I would like to talk about is uh, the um, ascension, second coming, third coming of the man called Jesus. Now, we have been given so much information that some people sort of believe really that he will be coming on the clouds again and he will take those who have made a confession that he is the Son of God. Now, as far as I'm concerned, that is more or less a message of fear. You know, when people who say, well, I have uh, met Jesus as my Savior, and so I will be taken up in the clouds and everyone else will be left behind. That is not exactly how God works. God is the source that is filled with love and compassion for everyone. And even Jesus said he wouldn't want anyone to be lost. And he meant that. Now, many of us, we think, oh, well, if I live a righteous life, I will go. Now, there will be a kind of ascension this year in September uh, 2017. That means something's going to happen uh, to human beings and to the earth that has never ever happened before in the history of the universe. You will or people will ascend. Now, depending on your consciousness and depending on your perception, some of you will ascend and some of you will not. If you still hold on to three-dimensional or 3D thoughts, you will, of course, stay on the earth when things happen and things are going to happen drastically in September of this year. And if you um, hold on to a fourth dimensional way of thinking, your consciousness has been raised to fourth dimension, then you will be observing what's going to happen on the earth without any state of fear. You will simply observe it because if you see things from the fourth dimension, then you will see things in a different light. If you view things from the fifth dimension, of course, you will ascend as to everyone else. All those who are thinking or have the consciousness of the fifth dimension will ascend and their bodies will change. Um, the people who you will leave behind will perceive as if you have died, but you would not have died. You'll, your bodies will simply would have changed and they will be translated into light bodies. And you will be, you will ascend to a new earth, a new heaven and a new earth where principles of love, peace and compassion are the order of the day. Dual thinking, of course, where you think you are separate and you have this fear-based thinking, you will, of course, stay still on the earth in the three dimension, in 3D. Now, whether you believe this or not, it's going to happen. You know, we are going to undergo this change, this dramatic change in uh, September. And if you align yourself with the source, you align yourself with God, you align yourself with the source, and you recognize the fact that the source, that God lives within you, then you will or you might ascend to higher planes. You might ascend to the higher um, consciousness plane where things will change, where there will be heaven on earth for you. Because this is changing, you see. It, it has only taken a small amount of humanity to have a higher consciousness, the consciousness of compassion and love. And that's all that is. And my suggestion to you is hold on to this 
love and compassion. Just hold on to it and see yourself as one with all. You are one with your other fellow human beings. You are one with the animals. You are one with Gaia, our Mother Earth. You are one with God. You are one with the Creator. And if you see yourself as that, you will, you might, you might not, but you might ascend uh, with everyone else who uh, has this higher frequency and this higher consciousness. And so all you need to do is to raise your consciousness. Now, where did I get this information? Of course, Jesus himself told me this. And I believe him when he, when he tells me this directly in my heart. And this is the information I got. And so I believe it. And I also believe that he comes back. He is coming back and speaks to uh, hundreds of people. Sometimes he channels through people and sometimes he speaks through people because he wants to put things straight that he is not the Jesus that is spoken of for the last 2,000 years, the one who's coming to judge everybody. He is a light being of love and compassion and would love you and I to simply take over this compassion and this love within your hearts. So the ascension is going to happen. And my suggestion to you is fear not. Do not be afraid. Everything will be all right. Everything will be fine. You will be fine. Your body will simply translate into a lighter body when this happens. And um, you are simply part of the children of light. So be a light unto the world. Simply just be the light. You don't have to do anything but just be the light. Okay, thank you very much and uh, talk to you again. So namaste and uh, peace be unto you. Bye for now. Talk to you again in the next video.